how to attract millennials to your conference. I find that most conferences that I attend are structured as though the attendees don't have the sophisticated tools of the 21st century at their disposal. For instance, millennials don't stay up to watch someone deliver the weather forecast at the end of the evening news like matures or even some baby boomers might do. In fact, they don't stay up to watch somebody read them the news at all. No, they have instant access to better information from the Weather Channel and similar apps right on their phones. Yet many association events are still designed as though the internet doesn't even exist. Believing that the primary way attendees will still get the information they need is by attending the association's gatherings once or twice a year. This is the association's equivalent of having the television meteorologist tell attendees what they need to know. These organizers fail to realize that much of the information being presented in the concurrent sessions could now be accessed by attendees through a simple Google search after just a few seconds of effort. Articles, recorded webinars, and white papers are there for instant assimilation. Why should attendees pay hundreds or even thousands of dollars and spend dozens of hours dealing with travel hassles just to get the same information? And do they, or you, really enjoy just sitting in silence for days? In addition, they may have already seen a YouTube video of the same presentation your keynote speaker will deliver to every association he or she works for. Why should they sit through it again? Be a hero. Provide an experience instead. For future association events to be attended and successful, they'll need to provide experiences. Conferences, for their continued existence, will need to do more for attendees than simply dish out information. They will need to provide something that becomes harder and harder to get anywhere else face-to-face -face interaction with like-minded people. Web Savvy Generation Y now comprises the largest segment of the workforce and represents the future of your association. The majority of attendees in my sessions are indeed millennials. I have learned from my experience with them that they're quite different from the matures, baby boomers, or Generation X which preceded them. Here's a tip. Make it be about the millennial, not the speaker. Millennials are probably the most social, of all the generations and crave interaction with others the most. Millennials in particular dislike being lectured at by a speaker or having to endure yet another canned presentation, but they certainly enjoy helping to create a script in real time. They no longer want a conference presentation to be all about a particular speaker, they want the presentation to be all about them. Not only do other speakers and I offer an interactive opening keynote address, Scheduling an address as the closing general session can also make the difference between the overall success and failure of the conference. For instance, last month I was told by a conference organizer, we did not end well yesterday. We needed to discuss some changes in policies and procedures that nobody was happy about. They left the conference grumbling yesterday. I certainly hope you can turn things around this afternoon. Well, the last thing they needed to hear at that point was how somebody whom they would never see again successfully scale Mount Everest or endure to win an Olympic gold medal. Instead, within minutes after beginning my presentation, I could sense an immediate change in the spirit in the room. After our opening interactive activity, which was a welcome change after a day and a half of just sitting and listening, people were talking, smiling, and laughing with each other. After the event, the organizer sent me an email which read, I have had many people come by and thank me for inviting you to present at our meeting last week. Everyone had a great time, and they also learned a lot about themselves and their coworkers. You did a great job and had great energy. Thank you for helping to make our event a success. Here's the bottom line for conference success. The point is to do something different during your conference this year. Don't let the speakers on stage have all the fun where your audience is limited to being passive onlookers, learning all about the speaker's successes. In fact, don't just schedule speeches but instead actually create experiences for your attendees.